Hello there, this is uh, Isaac from the Crafty Miners, and um, I'm trying a new recording software. I'm making this video uh, to basically explain our absence, uh, and that was, our absence has simply been um, the fact that Nick and I got really busy. Well, actually, the main reason is um, our, we were both running video capture trials. They were just trials of what the program we were using, and they ran out. So we couldn't use it anymore unless we paid money, uh, and we didn't want to do that. So I'm trying a different program right now. Uh, I'm not sure when we're going to make more videos, actual ones, um, because just for different reasons, but uh, we want to. So um, what you should do is you should uh, send us post comments on this video or send us message or whatever uh, for what you uh, ideas for what you think we should uh, subjects what the subject should be for our next videos if we post any more what they should be about just give us some ideas and help us um, so we don't just try to pull something out of nowhere but I thought what I'd do is I'd show you um, what I what I can do is I can show you my own world the world that I'm playing with right now um, and I, I called it overhill and underhill because of the basically the way I've built it. Uh, I kinda like it, these glass things. This this is back when they had when when one point eight first came out. Uh, so it still has the glass beams that notify that show you where the fortress is. So actually there's a fortress right beneath me, but I haven't explored it yet, even though I've played this for a long time. But I built this home basically into a hill. And um, so, pull off the path. So I've got, of course, my, my rainbow sheep. Always have rainbow sheep. Um, we'll go into my house in a little bit. It's not too big, but up here I have my farmland. I have my wheat and sugar cane. A great way to grow sugar cane. All you have to do is um, just uh, make a strip of water like this and then put sugar cane all the way around it and sugar cane will grow and then when you want to harvest it harvest the top two just hit the middle one and it breaks the two off but leave the bottom one and then oh man my inventory is full I'm going to drop rotting flesh because I don't want that um, I was out exploring apparently before this so my inventory is full of garbage but uh, so you break these off and then you just harvest it all and actually what I like to do is whenever I find sugarcane if it's in the vicinity of my home and I know where I'm gonna find it again is I'll take the sugarcane and I'll break it I'll, I'll break off all the tops and then I'll plant more around the water that it's growing by that way the next time I find it there's even more sugarcane there um, and it just keeps spreading like that and I've actually surrounded entire ponds with sugarcane it looks really cool, but so I've got that. I'm working on this statue. It's like an Atlas statue I saw. Actually, one of my one of my other friends uh, did one, and so I I basically I copied him because I liked it. And I haven't built the cube yet because I did I don't know what I want to put the block that he's gonna he's gonna hold a massive block on his shoulders, but I haven't figured out what that's gonna be yet. So I'm actually hadn't gotten that far. I didn't want it to be just regular stone. So, um, my farm, my animals, I got my pigs, and my cows, and chickens. And I gave chickens plenty of room because I want to keep uh, breeding them more. In fact, I think I'm actually going to make more chickens right now. Why aren't you? Why aren't you working there? Did I just open something. How did you get out here? What the heck? No, come back. Come over here. How did you even? I don't even understand. 
But yeah, uh, so I got this farm area that I've been working on. Uh, and so, <clears throat> follow me into my home. It's a, it's a tiny little place, but I really like it. Um, my bed and a chest with all my dyes, because I got my sheep. I don't know, it's just random stuff. Uh, we'll get to that in a second. This is my tiny little workshelf area. Uh, my workshop. It's got all my supplies, and actually, I probably need to empty this out, but um, that's a back way out. Down here is my enchanting room, so I can enchant my weapons. And you might have heard some mooing. That is because I have a kitchen. There's cake. Uh, I was baking a bunch of cakes, and I needed a lot of milk, and I didn't feel like going out and getting a bunch of milk or making a bunch of bu buckets, so I made a room with a cow in it. So now I have a cow in my kitchen all the time for whenever I need milk. Uh, Nick calls that lazy. I call it brilliant. So I don't know what his problem is. Of course, I got all my food supplies in here. Um, and oh, it's getting dark. Uh, my back entrance. This is a really nice place. There's, an, there's a desert that way. And then that's an NPC town. And basically, for some reason... I guess this is a blessing. Um, monsters don't spawn in this back area. Like, and there's a lot. Of, there are a lot of light spots, so I guess that could be it's just because of where our monsters spawn, and then where I have the light placement. It's just really difficult for monsters to spawn here. But about the only time I ever find, I'll find like one zombie in the back here as I'm walking home from killing monsters. Um, so, I think that's about all I've got. This is a nice little home, and I've just been digging up uh, mining and collecting supplies and um, considering playing playing the game to beat it, because you can finish the game now. There actually, there's an ender. You get to the ender. And I could, but I don't know. Nick and I were trying to... We were on a, a server we started shortly after we stopped making videos. We started a server and we wanted to go all the way to the very end of the game and uh, we haven't gotten there yet but uh, if we're going to soon then I'm not going to finish it on this game and then maybe we'll post videos about such in the future but yes that's what I so that's what I, that's your homework uh, if you want us to continue making videos we need you to show your support uh, share us spread us spread the word about us uh, get more people to like us, follow us, blah, blah, blah. And, uh, comment, leave comments in this video, or in this, uh, leave comments on the video and, or send us messages as to what type of videos you want to see from us, um, that we have not already done. So, uh, that is all for now. And, uh, check us out at Tumblr, uh, thecraftyminers.tumblr.com. Uh, I believe. I could be lying to you. I actually don't remember. Um, but I will see you and if the next time, if there is a next time, which I really hope there is, and I'm sure Nick does too. So, uh, farewell.